1892, fresh out of college, John Heisman got his first coaching job at Oberlin College. In the following 30 years of his life, Heisman went on to coach at the University of Pennsylvania, Auburn, Clemson, Washington, Jefferson, and Rice. What Heisman considered to be his greatest triumph was helping to legalize the forward pass. In an interview with Chris Potter of the Boise State Broncos, Potter stated that a forward pass is when an individual behind the line of scrimmage throws the ball in front of them. It just has to be in front. After 30 years of coaching, Heisman went on to become the athletic director of the Downtown Athletic Club of New York City, which was first established in the 1920s. He helped the club establish such programs as basketball, squash, bowling, and other youth activities. Through Heisman's peer determination, the Downtown Athletic Club was able to stay in business until the terrorist attacks on September 11, 2001. During that time, Heisman helped create the Downtown Athletic Club Award, which was later renamed the Heisman Trophy after Heisman's death. Since the trophy was first given out, there has been an interesting phenomena about how the trophy is treated after it is won. J. Burr Wanger, who first won the trophy, gave it to his aunt, who later used it as a doorstop. Others have put it on their kitchen floor and got the trophy a first-class seat on an airplane. When asked what he would do if he won the trophy, Potter replied, I would feel very blessed if I won the Heisman, and I would thank God immediately, because I know that he would be the only reason I won that award. I would probably give the trophy to my school. Over the years, the requirements to be a candidate for the trophy have greatly increased. When Burwanger won the award, he won with a mere 80 points in his senior year. Since then, he has become the only winner to win the trophy with less than 100 points in the season. When asked about what it takes to be a candidate for the Heisman, Potter stated, I think to be a Heisman candidate, you have to be a very hard worker and someone that can be looked up to on and off the field. Although that second part is often overlooked by talent on the field. When asked who his favorite Heisman winner is and why, Chris Potter stated that Tim Tebow is his favorite winner. I believe that he is a very hard worker. Not too many people can do what he is able to do. Plus, he is very strong in his faith, and he implements his faith in his sports. However, when asked about the candidates, Potter replied, I think they are people who have worked really hard. They should feel blessed because they are a few of many in college football who are being recognized for their achievements. In other words, Potter states that in order to win the trophy, you have to work hard and be well-respected. You have to be like John Heisman.